Hello everyone. I would like to tell you something about the project that I am uh, doing here. I want to make a greenhouse right here behind me. A greenhouse round with a diameter of 13 meters and then shaped like this with a pentagon, pentagram and then going on like this, like this, like this, like this, but I can better show on a model which is actually exactly like I want to build the greenhouse. That is here. This is a model of the greenhouse that I want to make. So imagine that here. And so uh, this greenhouse this is uh, using a structure which is a structure that I've invented which has a more harmonious distribution of energy and uh, therefore it can be made with uh, less material or cheaper material and the structure occurs like this into one continuing spin and so it uh, is self-supportive bites itself in the tail and uh, so it is one continuing flow I call it the power flower because it has a, a more harmonious flow of power or energy and so that makes it possible to make it uh, from less material and cheaper material and therefore cheaper so this can be the cheapest greenhouse in the world and uh, greenhouses they are uh, very good because you don't need so much water because all the water that is used inside it is uh, when it evaporates especially in hot Africa the water stays inside the greenhouse and so you don't use as much water and also by using this uh, less amount of water, you can uh, use the water for having your harvest all year, so you don't depend on the seasons of the rainy season or the dry season where you can't grow any food. This structure is uh, uh, with uh, five minutes which is also like our immune body with fiveness like a star but then the fiveness is in seven steps as you can see here there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven and then it goes back six, five, four, three, two, one which is also on my t-shirt but then in colors the seven colors of the rainbow Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, violet, and then going back to purple, blue, green, yellow, orange, red, continuing. So this is fiveness in seven steps. Fiveness can also be in three steps, which I can show here. This is same fiveness, so here, here you can see the pentagram in the center, and now it has one, two, three steps, and then going back. So this has one, still one infinite spin, infinite material, in three layers, in the same way this one is the same fiveness in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven layers. And so that's the structure. It is woven from one continuum material and it is in fiveness. And uh, this is the structure which is also used by nature, as I can show here. Here's a pine cone. See? Pine cone. And the pine cone also has these spirals that are coming to the top and then going back 
down again and then coming back to the top and then going back down again and so this is actually structure that nature uses when it's growing this is not only in a pine cone this is also in a pine apple or in uh, every budding plant in spring has a growth tip which is actually looking like this also flowers like the rose it's very evident how it is also using this pattern but once you get the eye for it you can see it everywhere around us in nature up to the spiraling arms of the galaxies and so this structure is uh, how the greenhouse will be looking and that means that the greenhouse shape will be like resonating with the shapes of the plants growing inside it so and also with our own human shape all uh, edible plants have flowers with five petals so that is also how the resonation between the humans and the food we eat is already there so let it also be there in the place where the food grows so they can all support each other in a greater harmony and this greater harmony can also be used as a way to live here I have a structure which is also the same power flower structure going around and around and around and around and this is at the center of five separate living units and so this can be a living structure for like one family where there's uh, five members of the family having their own separate space all coming to the center communal space which is a balance between uh, division and unity one could say and uh, this structure could be then having a communal living area in the center or it could have a greenhouse in the center where all the people involved are working at the same greenhouse for their self-sustainability or it could have five families one, two, three, four, five families one communal central place and then around that area having this as I have on my t-shirt where this space is then in this central pentagon and around that there is water canals flowing like this in between the land and so that could be for the distribution of water help uh, in that that is like a future wish uh, to make this power flower structure into a uh, living unit for now I want to uh, start showing this model and uh, the possibilities with it by building a greenhouse right here in the garden and so yeah, this is the garden uh, of the house where I'm living I'll show you uh, here is the, the mountain of Mount Kenya we are living here on 2000 meters high and Mount Kenya it is more than 5000 meters high and so uh, that's the place where I want to build this and maybe if you turn on then you can see the house where I'm living right now and so uh, the owner of this house has uh, been so kind to let me use this uh, land here behind me which he's actually using himself for the growing of vegetables he's growing corn and potatoes uh, here and so uh, every inch has been used but uh, I would also like to build this greenhouse but I don't have the money to rent the garden and so we came to a fair trade corporation where if I build the greenhouse here then we share the harvest and we work there together and so he can be happy to have more harvest than uh, he would have without the greenhouse and I am happy to be able to build the greenhouse to also have uh, some food for myself 
but also mainly as a model so I can show everyone that the structure is working, how it's working, and that it can really make the cheapest greenhouse in the world. And so for that, I would like to uh, ask your support. And uh, after this first greenhouse has been established, uh, other people are also then able to see how it works and then more can come from that. But for this first greenhouse, I don't have enough uh, money to buy all the materials. And so, uh, yes, I kindly like to ask your support to make this structure become a reality. Thank you very much.